hello guys welcome to another challenge pets of pro let's get started it's a fun challenge especially the part where we uh put course the login credentials with uh turbo intruder um so basically it's a simple website where you can buy pets picture um by simply adding it to the cart and then checking out so we just bought this picture for 8.95 dollar the first thing talks about uh buying this picture for free so i'm already intercepting my um uh, proxy my request to the bob suite so if i go here so this is where i checked out uh if you see this part this has been encoded to url so i can send this uh, encoded url to uh decoder and then i decode this url back to url and we have to change this price to zero and then uh, so and then such that the server will be able to understand this we have to encode it back to url simply copy this and then let's first send this to repeater because we want to repeat this request and then paste the encoded url and now let's make the request so it's a 200 so that way uh, we just bought this uh, picture for uh, zero dollar and we also got our first flag and for the uh, second flag we'll uh, like to administer or uh, login into the page and then use some kind of a tool so the first thing we want to do is to uh, find a login portal so usually the uh, websites they have their login portal in the site of the name slash login so make let's make that assumption and yeah that's it that's our login portal uh, in case you want to find more uh, directories uh, you can use this tool called fof return and go it's a fast tool for uh, directory brute processing so let's go back to our login portal so we like to log in so uh, let's try some most common uh, username and password combinations that will be uh, admin admin but like none of these will work so we get a very nice hint here it says invalid username so it seems like it's checking the username first so how do we log in one thing we can do is try to brute force this username by using a huge word list and once we find a valid username we will uh, brute force this password and once we find both of the valid username and password we'll use them to log in so for the word list i have a wonderful uh github repository called checklist uh go into the username and then to the names and then we're going to use this name set txt to brute force our um, uh username uh, i'm also if i go back to my proxy here you can see the logins and then again guys our intruder and the, the bot intruder uh, it's too slow in the community version so i'm going to use uh turbo intruder you can find it into the web store and once you have installed it now what we can do is simply uh, select this username and then send this to turbo intruder this is one of the fastest tool for making huge amount of request uh, if you know python this will look familiar this function is responsible for making a uh, request uh, this function is responsible for uh, filtering out the responses so we are filtering out the responses uh, that doesn't have the keyword invalid username because you know right if the uh, if you put uh, uh, invalid username uh, it will uh, response out uh, invalid username so wouldn't want that so let's start our attack uh, and guys this is where my word list is so let's start our attack uh it's making a huge amount of requests in such a small amount of time um let's wait for a while so uh, this tool made more than uh, 4000 requests in less than three minutes i guess that's pretty fast i uh, have this response it says invalid passport so uh, this is definitely a valid uh, username so i want to bid for passport now for that uh, for that let me choose this and then send this to turbo intruder and guys again i have to use gainor the uh, username that we just found and percentage s is where it's going to brute force the attack uh, and now we'll have to use a different word list for this uh, that will be password okay, credentials 10k most common at text to word list uh, so let's replace this so this is where i clone these uh, wireless into my system and again we have to change this to invalid password because now we are uh, trying to filter out the responses 
and it doesn't have the uh, invalid password keyword in the response and that will be okay let's start our attack so in less than two minutes we got one positive response uh, and yeah we are redirected to something else and then the password is eat me so let's try to uh, maybe credentials we found gain or init me login and tana guys that's our second flag uh, and for the third flag it's talking about some kind of input and appearing at somewhere else so it's hinting to this edit page so we have three input fields so we can try either a uh, sqli or a xss injection so let's try to create an xss injection uh, that will be script a lot let's put name so we can see where they're coming from description let's try to save this but we get an internal server error so i thought on this for a while and it's most probably because you know like in the database we have configured name and description to be characters which they are but price has to be an integer so it's not letting us enter this uh character so let me simply replace this with zero for instance and then let's try to save this okay and then yeah just got saved let's go back to the home page and then let's try to refresh this and ta -da, we got name and for the description uh let's add this item that we just changed uh the name and description to the cart again okay 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 description and guys ta -da, that's our uh final flag so that's it for this video guys if you have any question leave it down in the comment section see you guys in the next video bye bye take care